Hey guys, welcome to a new video. So today I'm going to show you the basics with the uh, RFID RC5522. Today I'm going to show you uh, more in detail the uh, read and write function. So let's get started. So for this project you can use an Arduino Uno, Mega, Nano, Leonardo, Micro or Pro Micro. I will use the Nano for this project. So, uh, But that doesn't matter really at all. Uh, so you just have to put the pins in another. The thing you will definitely need is the, of course, the RFID RC five hundred twenty two reader and some wires or yeah, the deck or decks and uh, and uh, an Arduino of course. So now I'm gonna go over and explain to you how this is, uh, Arduino code works and how you can find it. So first you have to go to sketch, include library and then manage libraries. Here you can find for RFID and you will find this uh, here MFRC522, this is the one we have. So hit it and hit install if you haven't already. So then you can close this. Then you have to go to file, um, examples, scroll all the way down. And then you will find the MFRC522. So here you got a lot of uh, things which I will be making more videos about probably. But today we're gonna focus on these two things, the read and write. So first I'm gonna start off with the write. So hit that and you will uh, get this uh, code program. Before we're gonna upload the code to the Arduino, we're gonna uh, build everything together and for that you will need this information right here and uh, I have the nano as you can see so I have to put uh, these these pins here into these pins but if you have another Arduino for example the Uno you have to put this in these pins but for, uh, that's everything that's uh, a difference between another Arduino so I will step over to my Arduino so as you can see, you can see here the names of the pins and that's also the one you will see in the code on the left side. So you will uh, have to focus on these by connecting the, the pins to the Arduino. So I'm gonna plug it in my uh, breadboard right now. And then take the uh, wires and start connecting. So first I have to connect these pins to the Arduino, which is my case the Arduino Nano and you can see here the names like SDA, SLK, MOSI, MISIO and all these things and these are also the names you will see here and if it doesn't stand right here then it doesn't matter in which pin so like the GND for example doesn't stand in the program but that is uh, of course just in the GND or your Arduino so Keep that in mind, and then uh, I will connect it and be back when I've done all the uh, connecting. So as you can see, I got uh, everything connected to my Arduino right now. So I'm gonna uh, connect my Arduino now to my PC and uh, upload the write code. So now that everything is connected and uh, the code is uploaded to your Arduino, you can open up your serial monitor on your PC, and then uh, you have to and then you have to scan your tag and keep it there and then it will also type family name ending with hashtag so type your name in my case Meyer and end up with a hashtag and hit enter now it will ask your first name so of course you can fill in anything you want oh that's my camera that fell and then hit hashtag again and hit enter so now it's a success and you can Pull it away, and that's everything you have to do for the uh, write code. So now you have to click on file, um, sketchbook, uh, examples, MFRC 522, and RFC ID read personal data. Open that one and upload this one on now to your Arduino. So So now that that's uploaded, you can open up the serial monitor here too, and then you have to 
scan your tree if your uh, little code thing so keep that on there and you will see your name and this is only with this one because when I use this one which is a program that will just say nothing it will just say my card ID and by name it will say nothing so uh, yeah that's pretty much it I hope you enjoyed it I will make more videos about this uh, about the RVD reader in the future don't forget to like subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one peace out